Alt. Yeah, it's like women's reparations, but like you yeah, just gotta really go is. for a Bill O'Reilly. Anyone who fucks Kumia or like Pat over here for money is a moron. I'm done. Wow. Yeah. Anyone who fucks Kumia for money, which is everyone, <laughs> is a moron. You don't say that to the Count's face. I mean, this guy's sharpening up uh, you know, his teeth. <laughs> Can somebody do expert animation of every time the count opens his mouth, it does that true blood fang thing? Because that's easy to do. Even in true blood, it looked so real, but really all you're doing is taking two, two fangs and superimposing them and making them shoot out. It's pretty easy to do with a little sound effect. We should have moments where it cuts to the count. There's a little silence. Then, it, I mean, that'd be easy to do. It'd look real. It's, it's what they did in true blood. We should call the people who created True Blood, show them this count stuff. They can make a new series. You know, more reality version. It's kind of like the Roanoke American Horror Story. You know, it's a little more rugged. They could do it. Come back. The Count. This is a guy. It's a vampire who hosts this show. You know, be a good series. Got money. Retard. Yeah, but not oh, like no, he's, not settlement yeah, money. Not in no, the same. you have like some, let's take right. a dinner cruise money. Like you don't have money. money, money. Like, like I got money where girls will fuck me. Have you ever? She said you don't have money, money. You have let's take a dinner cruise money. <laughs> and he's going, I have money. So that's another shout down to the scarf. Or, I mean the what is it called? The count. Yeah. <laughs> have you? Well, that's just. Scarf. Have you ever paid out for a secret? What do you mean? Have you ever paid uh, someone off? Have you ever paid out for a secret? And Count goes, what do you mean? Let me see the fucking tape. <laughs> have you ever paid out for a secret? So they're assuming he has. Fuck Shut up, bitch. No. 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 I mean, I guess you don't pay and then talk about it. Or she's out there. We're oh, gonna... he looks at the camera. <laughs> How do I get out of this one? <laughs> Those are where the fangs should come out. Find her. I don't know. I... I don't know. I said there was a there was a girl back in 1980. Oh, here we go. Everyone needs to stop what they're doing. A lot of people doing extracurricular work in the background right now, listening to the bar. Everyone needs to stop and stare at your audio player. He's about to talk about the 80s. Now, when he says the 80s, he's probably talking more about 2008 crimes. But he says 80s to make it sound older. The Count is now about to admit to his most dastardly crimes yet. Here we go. That uh, we, and she was like my girlfriend, but we were drunk, we slept, we were asleep, and then she woke up, we woke up in the morning, and she said, uh, did we have, like, anal last night or something? I'm like, Who cares that? I don't know. I think I, I like, I did. <laughs> um, but she no, didn't know. She was I passed. did. I don't know if you did. She but... was passed out. So, like, you know. You know you put it in her butt. So that would probably be, like, bad, You'll right? feeling it the next morning, bro. <laughs> you, know, yeah. you know she was asleep when you fucked her up the ass. Was it fun for you? Yeah, I think, I you think. like, fucking a corpse rape. in the ass. Is that rape? Yes. You raped a person. She you just asleep admitted it. And you Anal put rape, it in her yeah. ass. You raped a person. You ju just admitted it in the count with no confidence. Because, yes. <sighs> As if he's actually excited about it now couple things the count has brought this story up three times in the last two months he's nervous about it but there are many other tales from the crypt i'm sure that he's been a part of but for some reason he keeps telling this story and the story gets a little more cozy each time i'll explain well, it was my girlfriend. I mean, we were dating, and, uh, you yeah, know, I was like... I don't think this was your girlfriend, and I'll tell you why. You've told this story three times almost to get ahead of the troubles to come. I didn't hear the girlfriend part the first two times. And why would you be so worried? If I have a girlfriend, I own her. I do what, if you're in my bed and you're my girlfriend, whatever happens is happening. That's how I look at it. I wouldn't be worried about that if it was my girlfriend. I don't think this was your girlfriend. I think this was some girl. And I think you butt fucked the hell out of her while she slept. 
with vamp rage. She woke up probably really pissed about it. Otherwise, you wouldn't bring it up. You know how many girls I've sleep banged? Two. They loved it. They woke up excited, engaging in the act, consenting, and craving more. Sir, I don't talk about it. I don't bring it up with extreme guilt three times within the Louis era. The Count does. The Count brutally anally raped a woman while she slept. He said that, not me. What else has the Count done? Now, before he even told this story, I showed you one of my visions that I had. My vision was of the Count brutally fucking a girl from behind, tossing her off the bed as soon as he finished, and going to the bathroom naked while farting, and all you see is a shot of his butt. Now, and he's taking a piss. Now, why did I have this vision? Well, I got one thing wrong in my vision that I had. He wasn't fucking her doggy style, and she wasn't awake. <laughs> he was butt fucking her up the ass and she was sound now did he take a piss after this I hope to get that shit out of the urethra the count is a sick man um, he is about to pretend cheerlead his rape as if he's not ashamed of it wait till you see what the guys in the booth do once they for the fourth time, for the third or fourth time, hear about Kumia's admitted rape. Watch this. Very sick. I think like fucking that a corpse rape. in the ass. Is that rape? Yes. You raped a person. She you just asleep admitted it. And you Anal rape. <laughs> I love the chat. There are no limits from that diabolical son of a bitch. Yeah, we don't call people son of a bitch enough ar around here. Count Kumia is a son of a bitch. You know, he's evil. So yeah, yeah. Done. Look, at, done. look at his henchmen. Hold on, I gotta back this up a little bit more. Watch his little weak Garrett and John in the booth, these weasels. Watch them cheer on Kumia for the rape. Bye. So that would probably be like bad. Right? We'll feeling it the next morning, bro. <laughs> you knew, yeah. You knew she was asleep when you fucked her up the ass. Was it fun for you? Yeah, I think. I think. Like fucking that a is corpse rape. in the ass. Is that rape? Yes. You raped a person. She you just asleep. Look, you know, rape too. Yeah. Wow. Done. Cut nice to one. the booth, and these guys just won't admit they're working for a terrible guy. Like, how much do they need to know? So what they do is the same thing Kumia does, where it's, hey, just pretend that this is awesome. Instead of admitting, Garrett and John should be like, you know what? And leave. Sorry for showing you my ears. <laughs> <laughs> but <laughs> they instead bury their own guilt pretending, oh, yes, Kumia, Count Kumia, butt fucking... How many prank calls do they need? How many times do they need to be reminded that everyone they work for is a piece of shit? And they continue, oh, we cheer on the count for his rapes. <laughs> They're despicable. Eargate, now I'm hearing. Fuck. Nice. Got away with fuck. it. Hey, fuck. Hey, Got crooked away with boy. It. We, were both, we were both. We were both drunk. That's disgusting. We were both. Yeah. She even points. It, I didn't know that. She even points to the booth and goes, "They're disgust. That's disgusting." For cheering on count. 2018. I might start laying the pressure on Jared and Gone and John. Gone. Whatever. Jared and John. I'm coming for you this this year. Let's get all their truths up on the big screen. They're part of the show. They just cheered on a rape. Garrett and John, it's time to put the pressure on them. I want every secret they have. Dig up their secrets and send them to me. <laughs> Cameron, Cameron, it's time to take a road trip to New York, Cameron. Just you and your old police car. I want everything on Jared and, Ga and John. Garrett and John. Mike gone wild, flashing his ears. <laughs> Fuck. Cut them ears off. Seeing Mike's ears is the equivalent of seeing his naked buns. <sighs> I knew you guys were going to love that. 
Uh, okay, let's uh, continue. Both You're drunk. Both drunk. You also got raped. You were saying you were awake, though. She I was, was drunk. Why am I, I was supposed drunk. to have any kind of responsibility when I'm drunk? So why don't you murder someone while you're drunk? See if you could get away with that. He's done that. Uh, you're, he so will. Nutty. you're so I'm nutty. You're so nutty. He was drunk too. Why does yeah, she get the fuck? She wasn't drunk. She was passed He out. backed her ass onto my dick. Right. All right. That's different. She raped me. That's different. How do these women do that Did stuff? She pass out or not? She no, we were like. A... Was she passed out or not? And now he's gonna backtrack. No, we were asleep. That's best now. I. But I also don't consider that. Right. If you've already had sex, can't you have? You can't have sex with a sleeping person that's already had sex with you. Is that not allowed? But what if she's... Okay, here's the difference. If she had never had anal with him and had never done that with him for him to have anal with her, that's another level. That could be a rape, a rape. I don't know. What do you guys think? I don't care. I want women all to burn. You know, I could give a shit about this stuff, you know? As far as I'm concerned, the only reason they're around is to be hurt. But at the same time, I do see the point where you don't want to be sleeping. Imagine if you were sleeping, you woke up. Was I butt fucked by the count? I mean, that could ruin your whole life. So I do feel for any woman that was butt fucked while she was asleep by Anthony Count Kumi. <laughs> I got it. I mean, everyone should. Everyone's saying it's rape. Kumia's story is inconsistent. Can we get a back-to-back -back of him telling this story every time he's told it? I mean, surely somebody could put that together. He's told this story three or four times. Let's put those stories back-to-back -back and watch for the changes. Make that a YouTube video, send it to Radar Online, and then start popping champagne and confetti party poppers because it's New Year's. That would rule. I pray for this 1980s victim. Rape culture. Stand strong together with the victims. Well, your asshole would be bloody, so yeah, it's rape. Oh, yeah, because he's got the widest cock known to earth, known to man. A lot of people, uh, I said this in the letter, a lot of people, all the people they hate have small dicks. Not me. All the people I hate have giant fucking fat wads that go right in you, tear you up, tear up the walls, the vaginal walls. <laughs> Rip. Sleep, no, drunk, passed out, and then you know you you probably been with enough guys like that? that do that you half like that? asleep, half asleep hump thing. Just you go wake to a up nursing home, you, you fucking like I was her. doing that. Wow, you like that? You like that? Why don't you go to a nursing home, you fucking loser? You fuck, and he purposely tunes out those comments. If somebody called me a fucking loser in this home, there'd be a whoosh, before she knew. Knife to the throat via throne. <laughs> That's what would happen here. So to be called a fucking loser in your own studio, he's tuning it out. You see what I'm doing here with my ear? That's a tune motion. Yeah. Like that? A dead person? A fuck? Why don't you just go to some homeless park, you fucking crazy? I have. It's great. Ooh, and Jared are doing... 15 chins on that Garrett. Mm, I love my master cat. You're, I'm coming for this Garrett. Hey, you know how hard it is gross. to get a woman. Yeah, fucking gross. 1980. It was gross. It was Fuck. fucking gross. It was 1980. Was it? I guarantee you won no 80. Like, and I was a teen. Gosh. Oh. oh, you were a teenager. I was all fucking horned up. 1980? So why have you told this story four times in the last two months? <laughs> yeah, well, then, yeah, that's not rape. That's just good old-fashioned boys It was the boys. 80s. That was what we did. The 80s. We didn't know. It was this like the so warning sad. on cigarettes. We didn't know back then. This is so sad for you that you have to find oh, out later you're a rapist. Like, you you could just rape yeah, right up until 2017. Time, you know, yeah, yeah. yeah. Well, the, the standards now are different. Yeah, gross. Think that wasn't a big yeah, deal. Trash. You know, like, it's just some shit that happened. Nazis weren't war criminals till the U.S. won. No, you know what I mean? I drank right. poison. Remember? I see a difference. That's right. Like I just drank poison. Depending on who Don't won, rapists that's who to the Nazis, war criminals. Okay. Well, guess you what? The think... women are coming back, and you're a rapist now. So sorry, I poison. Wow. 1980s Kumia. 1980 rapist. Sorry, 1980s Kumia. 
Now, when did I do all this tape stuff? What was the year? The 80s. 1980. What? What year is it on those scarves? Let me check. We're going to give out some more scarves today. But look at this. Scars Club. 1981. Right there. Why? Why 1981? Could 81 have been the year of Kumia's ass fuck? I don't know. Could have came to me in one of my visions. I have visions. I had a dream all last night that I was shot six times by Al Callings, the guy who helped OJ. I spent the rest of the night trying to get into a hospital to get surgery for my bullet holes. And you know what I was told by the woman at the hospital? Get in line. You got 900 people in front of you. And I said, 900? The city needs to do something about this. She goes, what can we do? It's L.A. There are barely any hospitals here. Now, what did that dream mean? I don't know. But I also came up with this kooky 1981 number out of fucking nowhere. And all of a sudden, Kumi is talking about a rape in the 80s. I got a scarf that says scars. And it also says here... In the nightmare world of superstition and fear, it often becomes difficult to separate fact from fiction. A familiar story of bleep is case in point. Oh, I don't know. All these numbers are starting to add up. I'm seeing the 80s everywhere. <laughs> and here he is. He says 80s, 1980. It's very close to 81 if I was on some kind of game show where we're guessing numbers, values, and such. I'd be the winner. I'd be close enough. Look at that man. You tell me he ain't up to something bad. <laughs> Whoa! All right, let's continue, shall we? I don't know what the hell I'm talking about, by the way. This don't mean shit. Oh, man. Listen, if you all just admit it at once, we'll be overloaded with paperwork. We can't even... I have an idea. If we raise $25,000, can we just stab you? Oh, my God! <laughs> wait, 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 wait. Let's hear that again. Poison. 1980s Kumia. 1980 rapist. Don't mean shit. Oh, man. Listen, if you all just admit it at once, we'll be overloaded with paperwork. We can't even... I have an idea. Listen to this. If we raise $25,000, can we just stab you? If we raise $25,000, can we just stab you? I don't know who this girl is or what her agenda is, but... <laughs> is that not the coolest thing you've ever heard asked to the Count on his own show? If it, And that's out of nowhere. If we raise $25,000, can we stab you? <laughs> Captain Stabbin. Captain Stabbin. Can we stab you? Karen Feehan is her name. I say we start showing this girl a little respect. Around here. Mike is in love. No, 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 no. It has nothing to do with that shit. Respect. This is about respect. Thank you. But my wife should be worried. <laughs> so uh, if we raise $25,000, can we just stab you? That is fucking cool. Uh, let's continue. <laughs> continue. Twenty-five grand by tomorrow. Can we just stab the fuck? Can we out just stab the... you? I think you'll. <laughs> Count goes. Can we just stab? It? No, 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 no. It's not funny, Count. They're thinking about how shitty you are. Nobody ever has asked if they could stab me, and I have a lot of people who would love to do that. You got two girls thinking about that, raising some funds to do it to. Like it. You think? Yeah, I think you're mean and tough. It's awesome. Yeah? That'd be awesome. Right? You in? You've had to have guys that were like pulling some shenanigans, a drunk bingey night out or something. A lot of bars named shenanigans. Yeah, yeah. They used to put like Yankee. My biggest, the worst thing that a guy's ever done to me mm -hmm. 
Mike put a Yankee jersey on me while I was like passed out. While he, him and his friends probably fucked me. I don't know. I don't care. It's worse than ass okay. sex. Right? The Brutal. jersey's the issue. Huh? Pictures of me. Like, was the, who like, was the player, though? Who's the jersey? I don't remember. Um, I think Jita. That matters. I, mean, I, don't, I don't know what she's talking G- about. I've been assaulted like probably five times a year since I got to New York. Really? Hell yeah. Hell yeah. Mike oh, Fox, yeah. hot uh, bitch. Now, I have to ask you, what, what <laughs> qualifies as... Assaulted to you. Okay, There's Kumi always trying to disprove the victims. How about this story? <laughs> All right. <laughs> All right. Um, I'm at a I'm at a hotel bar where a lot of people are in the main in the main lounge. It's like a Billy Joel song. <laughs> I, um, <laughs> Good I one, walk count. towards the women's restroom. A guy pushes me in, locks the door behind him, and pushes me up against the wall, and I had to fight my way out of the bathroom. That was you. Yeah, no, it was a black guy. So Ooh, guilty. Oh, well, I oh, well, guess you have you a lot more in common guy. than you thought. All right. Now, the count's going to say something really funny here. Don't start loving him. No, see, now it makes perfect sense to me. There, see, if I... I didn't realize the bar was in a dark alley. I the mean, bar. I would say that's. A, I would say that's assault. Everywhere is that a is bar. If you're absolutely not assault. A sexual assault. How though. did you fight your way out? If I guess the black guy, who was it? Um, Urkel. <laughs> <laughs> who was you it? You know, Urkel? it was like it was all a blur. But if you're like. Yeah, yeah, like you duck and weave. I'm, I'm little. You were bobbing racist. and weaving. Racist. Totally racist. All a blur. Just a big black blur pushed into me. <laughs> Blurs. I mean, it's I didn't not... make out its features. <laughs> I mean, I could to know his name. <laughs> oh, I just punched toward the teeth and eyes that I <laughs> yeah, saw. As soon as I saw teeth, you know, I swung. But I have many stories. Like, Give me another one. Uh, I had a it's guy. It's sexual, though. I, okay, now the with... girl, Karen, has her back to the camera now and is just checking her wallet case, iPhone. Which the count has never had to put up with this before. Will he say anything? No. With me and was he was like Ew. had his mouth on his face. He made out with you. Like, oh. He was putting like he was trying to make Fucking out with me and he be pole burner. Him yeah. <laughs> he, he, he forced okay. you to kiss him. The intent was oh. sexual. Did you take? Did you? And he has tongue in your mouth. I I don't. I mean, this was a few years ago, but I imagine. Hmm. Like, as much as you could get it in. It wasn't like I had my mouth open waiting for a tongue. I wasn't t- mouth raped. No. Ooh, look at Kumi. Okay. Yeah, mouth rape is bad. Right, but like... Oh, she isn't like we're talking to the Micah. I don't know. Oh, sorry. she can hear you well and clear. So what happened next? next what turn. was the next one you said? Uh, oh, I mean, I don't I don't know about next, assault. but like, I've had like guys I've like... I've heard the story. It's crazy. I don't like listening to it. That's why I turned oh, it off. It's oh. a, she was It'd in a big video. She's very small. She almost died like twice in a story. Wow. You turned around because you were cracking up. I was like, why didn't she fucking die? No, but I've been chased. Uh, I've been chased out of bars, down subway no. steps, like she's been shoved into cabs. Yeah, like, she's been like by yeah. like comedians, by people we know. Like, she's in- wow, shoved into cabs by comedians we know. The new series from Hannibal Burris. <laughs> shoved in cabs with comedians. Now, the only comedian I know who ransacked into my cab was Hannibal Burris. Remember I told you a story about how we picked up a couple of chicks after this Red Bar event in New York. We were getting into a cab on our way back to the W Hotel. And right as the cab driver was starting to pull away, the door opens. It's Hannibal. I'm coming with you. He smushes us all into the back seat and comes back to the hotel with us. Shoving in Cabs with Hannibal Burress, a new show coming to the internet with me, Jerry Seinfeld. To a cab. I, physically, by comedian. Maybe you so shouldn't dress so sexy. I know, right? <laughs> Listen, you know. He's right, he's right. <laughs> Some it's, people enjoy Freddy Krueger's. You just, he just emanates so much sexuality. Yes. He's a text. Some people enjoy Freddy Krueger. <laughs> Yo, if I see him, I'm going to crack your jaw. He called her Freddy Krueger because she's wearing a red dress. I don't know. Does Freddy wear a red dress or does Freddy... Wear a burned face. It's come to you. I, I don't doubt it. Yeah, J Train. I, uh, I actually don't know if I've ever had consensual sex. <laughs> wow. That is an allegation. <laughs> I want that for my soundboard. Wow. That is an allegation. We need that for the soundboard because I could play that every time I say something about Kumia. Listen, you know. He's right, he's right. <laughs> Wait, Some people have... enjoy Freddy Krueger's. When you just, <laughs> when you just emanate so much sexuality, yes. these attacks come to you. I, I don't doubt it. Yeah, it is your fault. I, uh, I actually don't know if I've ever had consensual sex. Wow. <laughs>
<laughs> that is an allegation. That's what I want. Uh, no, that's pretty Me, good. consensual sex sounds like, like I don't know, like a or, Lilith right. Fair concert. Lilith <laughs> Fair. Nobody wants to go to one of no, those. No, consensual <laughs> sex. How are we supposed to know right. we can have consensual sex if there isn't that little chance you have to take to try to get to... Shout out to Chance. The consensual sex. Because you don't know just walking up and going, hey, let's have consensual sex. Like, you have to play the game, and sometimes the game gets interpreted as a, a, a like harassment. At least. Exactly, yeah, just asking a girl out yeah. if you, if you uh, you know, if she works What happened? You, what? Pat Dixon, one time you reached your hand over me. Come here, sit here. You're going to be Chrissy Mayer, and you're going to be me. She's right. setting you up for a sexual assault charge. Are you going to touch I'm me? I'm not a good actress. Right, this is crazy so coming up here. You're going to be me, though, Pat. I don't know, if, I don't know how I, I feel know, about Micah, this. you're me. Micah, I guess if everybody's moving, i got to do it. Okay, fine. Make it quick. What am I doing? So this is Pat. Don't worry, Pat. It's not live. It's taped. We could do anything with it. Okay, yeah. okay. You're, you're Kumi admits to editing. I'm Pat. I'm you're Pat. I'm so Pat. Hard your right ex-girlfriend. Now. I'm you. I'm Pat. I'm so hard. Okay, wait. Hold on. Let me get... Ooh, look at the Count's cackle. Look at that lizard laugh. Have you ever seen a Geico have such a good time? There he is. <laughs> Make the teeth shoot. Let me get in a mode as being you. Here you're we go. Me. Oh, you're wow. Right. Look at that. Yeah. Nice. Ooh, yeah. Nice shoulder. Are you, are you, you're kiss, Chrissy? Oh, you're being you're Karen. Chrissy. I'm Chrissy. Wait, I'm Karen. Oh, I'm Chrissy. Oh, what the oh, fuck? I'm just saying character. What are you doing? Yeah. a hitter, right? No, I didn't. I'm oh, oh, my God. God. Oh, really? no, she told people really? I did, though. Really? Yeah, see what happens? I'm joking. Yeah, that's why there's pictures. What are you talking about, me? Oh, man. So, so I just got assaulted. You did get assaulted. We so Pat Dixon is being treated like a complete and utter cuck, sitting there with his arms crossed, just being manhandled by two women. You well, saw it. You're rehearsing a sketch? It's like, on right tape. Right. right. Okay. Now she's groping you. Okay. Uh, totally. My God. You're I'm being, being you. I'm you're being you. Mean. No, I'm being Stop you. Uh, this is madness, huh? This is crazy. Somebody, yeah. Somebody says, this is a show. Yeah, if you're not watching the video version, what we're seeing on the screen, these video elements are quite startling. You've got zooms and cuts and and, and time warps and wraps. It's very weird. Yeah. Um, hi, you guys. More about me. So I'm Pat. And Pat okay, would what am I, reach what I, over. <laughs> Chrissy. Oh, my God. You guys have to switch seats. I'm so sorry. No. Watch this. Do you it. Right to begin do with? it. You dumb fuck. Just Which do the act. Do? Yeah, you're the <laughs> Uh, they flipped, they flipped us. They flipped us. Look in the camera, Ken. They flipped. They just turned it around. <laughs> Good job, nightmare. Crooked Dick. Nightmare. Nailed it. <laughs> so wait, uh, you uh, and I'm you. I'm still you. Who are you? This is not going to be worth it. He would reach over me to yeah. touch her boobs, so he would do this. Wait, I'm Chrissy oh, how now. Insulting I know. Must you're, have been oh, for you. yes, oh yes. wow, that okay. is insulting, so right? So he would go like this. Over my right. over my bib. So While my left arm, hand was on her. No, cunt. your whole forearm. Would be on my <laughs> Karen, why were you oh, in between him now. and his girlfriend? Not your boobs. The what? count is viciously jacking off into his funnel under the desk. Listen, I like to hang. Why? Well, yeah, she's. Why like, were you sitting between? She was like, that yeah, yeah, that's I weird. weird. I'm I'm here. Here. There wasn't even a chair. <laughs> Karen was just moving into his. Yeah, arm. why would you? <laughs> Sit between them then. Really, to, guys? To grope me here. Really? Not We're going to act like I'm a fucking four? Okay. He would go like four. this. He would go like this <laughs> and then reach Wait. and grab her boobs. You guys are getting this on camera right because I have a I, lawsuit being filed. I I'm love like, it. Hating her. Ugh, she was I like, know, that's groping. I know, but like my I boobs. couldn't grab your boobs. Who are you, Al Franken? No, no, no. But this, you, is, you, this is our Karen's boobs. Are so this is madness. It's Pat Dixon getting cucked. Uh, look at Pat Dixon's face. I mean, this is an utter fool. This is who Rye Japrikin looks up to. That's a way better Accurate. job than I Shut was up. doing. Accurate. Yeah. And boobs for care. <laughs> Nailed right it. These are fucking... Actually, so they're a little... His arm beat, would, like, like, jiggle my boobs while he grabbed her. Is this true, Pat? She wants so much to be groped right now. <laughs> if you're not asking to be groped, I no, want to grope her. That really is... Right, right. No, you're being unfair. That's being unfair. how it happens. No. Biologically, I want to That's how it happens, Pat. Count is throbbing over there, says Lauren in the chat. Yep. Count is throbbing. How much you want to bet Count went home? I bet you on the way out, Count grabs his little lunchbox and he says to John and Garrett in the booth, Hey, uh, send me an advanced copy of this episode. I know this isn't going to be posted for a few days, but uh, shoot me a link to my email so I could watch it when I get home. Okay, whatever you want, boss. And then he went in his sick red Supreme Leader room. Wait. 
I believe, do I have that here? I used to have an animation of the Count going nuts. Does anyone remember that one? Didn't we have an animation of the Count going ballistic on himself? I don't have that in front of me right now. I do have this. But didn't we have an animation of the Count going crazy on himself? Does anyone have a link to that? You know, I can't even find these things anymore because I don't know if I label them Kumia Count or Kumia with a K. So I can never find anything. Let's see what I got here. Kumia approved. Kumia, Kumia, Kumia. Show all in Finder. I got a lot of results here. I mean, Kumia. Come on. Show all in Finder. Is movie. Let's see what I got here. Kumia, 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 Kumia. Okay. No. Let's try count. Name matches count. I got nothing there. Kumia. Name matches Kumia. Nope, I can't find it. Let's see, is it... Nope. It was an animation of the count going nuts. Let's see if this is it. Yep, here it is. So this is what the count did to these tapes when he got home. shows have animations like that of their enemies? I doubt it. I highly, highly, highly doubt it. Did you hear that accordion go? Was that an accordion? Oh, shit. Oh, man, you look at the chat and you just see LOL. <laughs> Imagine never seeing that animation before. And then you seeing it tonight for the first time. <laughs> Holy shit. Discount good this time. Oh shit! <laughs> He's turned into a demon. Yes, that's I'm how it happens. Bring it they bring you up to the groping <laughs> point. <laughs> they bring you right up to the <laughs> threshold of the grope, exactly. and then you take over and grope, right and now you check. grope them. Green light, green light, green light. Like a yellow. Ah, right. uh, fuck. Right. You fucked it up again. You were supposed to grope, get him to grope you if you want money. <laughs> oh my god. We need to find out. Do you mom. think? In that, in that, See, that just played out. What's the problem with if, that? If Pat would have just grabbed your tit, would that have been inappropriate? Yeah, because he Why? was sitting next to my best friend who is dating and I respect her. Sometimes there's relationships. No, no, I mean like right now. During the right now, as you were acting it out, if Pat would have grabbed your tit, would that have been inappropriate? I mean, the thing is, Pat probably knows that I would backhand me, so it's him, so I don't think Pat would do it. No, it's my wife I'm concerned about. Ah, ah yeah. yeah. She'll hear. It's my wife. Okay, like, like the, but but regardless, someone will tell there's her. There's a boundary. Okay. The, but regardless, the no, question no, is, would you is think that was inappropriate? There's a boundary keeping him from doing that. It's manners. It's social niceties. He's not going to do it to embarrass me. No, you didn't cross any boundaries just now at all. Yeah, you slapped me in the face so five much, times and my ear. Got my dick all hard. Left it. You look so palsy right now. I'm very palsy. Whoa. It's been a bad year. Oh, <laughs> she says that to Pat Dixon. You look so palsy right now. You don't want a girl saying that to you. Look at him. And Pat Dixon just goes, ah, nah, nah, nah. that's cocked. When a man puts his head down after a slam from a woman. I like started smoking Superman again. Bell's oh. oh, it's the worst. It's, you know, Chrissy used to grab my cock all the time in public. Good for you. It was my we cock. Just, uh, that was your girlfriend. <laughs> hey, it's fun. Yeah, so what's wrong with reaching across you to get to her tits? Because I was involved in your sexual act. How were you involved? Because your whole forearm was on my top boob. This is, these are Karen's boobs. This is okay. orthodontic. Not, that's not top oh, boob. Dentist. That is just not boob. I'm going to explain something to you. This is dentist, orthodontist. She identifies as a Vagina woman. Vagina dentate. That. <laughs> right, right. How come um, girls are able to grab each other's... Vagina dentata. Remember that from the movie Teeth? I say that all the time. Every time I hear dent, I just go dentata. Remember that from the movie Teeth? The doctor goes, oh, uh, yeah, that's just vagina, vagina dentatus. Is that it? Yeah. Dentata? I don't like that movie Teeth. 
They need to make a movie about Kumia called uh, Teeth. <laughs> you know, why hasn't anyone uh, photoshopped that? Remember that movie, Teeth? Uh, I want it reworked with this guy. Count. His asses and tits and stuff out. Yeah. Yeah, out. Yeah, yeah. Everything's yeah. fine. No, no. Kumia. How come no one says anything about that? Because we're not afraid of getting killed by them, you stupid Idiot, fuck. You fucking Who's real? killing anyone? Oh, you stupid fuck, she calls him. You stupid fuck. Imagine saying that to the Count's face without immediately getting attacked by bats. I mean, the guts that these women's have. Just grabbing a tit. You keep killing us, you douche. And about, who's killing who? <laughs> who's killing who? All the oh, Count. Yeah, yeah. You want to count murders? What? Maybe what do we have? This motherfucker just yelled his own name. Did you hear that? I did. Killing us, you dude. Who's, who's, who's killing who? Who's killing who? Oh, count. Oh, count. Said his own name to try to remind them of who they're dealing with. It happened, and it happened live on Thaba. Yeah, yeah. You want to count murders? Maybe what do we add? Oh. What do we add? Fucking heart disease in the mix, then. And you'll see guys, you'll see guys Count? getting killed by women all the time oh with agra fucking vation. Whoa. That aggravation is a weapon. Make just, aggravation a fucking weapon okay, classification. Just because you smoke and don't work out, it's not our fault. You're, we make you angry. Uh, I don't smoke. Uh, drink. It works out. Kumi only smokes when the sun shines on him. Do I, should I, don't you should, I don't work Like out. a motherfucker. I smoke and don't work out. That was, it should have been for me, but I'll take it. Listen. No, it's... You whores. Men uh, aren't <laughs> killing women, like, like in random fucking... Anthony, Elizabeth, stop saying that. Oh, what? You need to find a new wife. You only have wife. two left. Fuck that. Yeah, he says, you need to find a new wife. That's a great way to describe how Kumia hooks up with chicks. He finds them. <laughs> find! Someone two left in your life that will like, never get married. Long Island, play with your weird big cats and hang out with you. Otherwise, you're stuck with all these fat retards. Cut it out. I will Whoa. never something get married. Something nice about a woman today. Seven, eight, five, six, seven, eight. Can't, can't really think of anything. <laughs> Say something nice you're about pretty. a woman. I saw some pretty girls outside. Ooh. They were walking down the street, and I'm like, that girl's really pretty. Yeah. Oh, imagine if the count said you were pretty. Shit, you're fucked, man. Oof. You ready for that eternity of hell? Said it out loud. I said it yeah, <laughs> I, said it, I said it out loud to the homeless. Do you even turn house. around to acknowledge you? Or oh, you no, I don't say it to them. Oh, okay. I follow them home. Sake. He doesn't hear me, and I couldn't follow them home without them <laughs> catching me. No, oh, I will shit. never get married again. That's insanity. <laughs> the count said, I follow them home. Something about they don't catch me. Oof. Imagine catching the count. That's almost scarier than not catching him. Institution that is. Like we, chicken after midnight. we never get Crazy. invited to comedian weddings. <laughs> Look at this one in the shit. Freezer, There's one in the freezer. I Ooh, that was a full ship. Did you see that? I need a giphy of that. Look at this. I want a gift so when I message Sven, it's like this. Watch this. Like Watch this. We never get invited to comedian weddings. Watch Kumia. Look at this shit. There's one in the freezer. Garrett. There's one in the freezer. I forgot. What are you looking for? Ooh. The ship of despair. I need a gif of that. I want that to, when I write count under search, under gifs, I want that to pop up. And then it can be all the Sesame Street stuff. But I want to type in count when I'm talking to my friends. That gif populates, him drinking the beer, and then I send it to my friends. Hey, Garrett. Right, Thank cool. you. Merry Christmas, Garrett. Please. Happy holidays. It's the ghost of Christmas Happy Budweiser. Oh. Happy Kwanzaa to the guy that locked you in the fucking bathroom. <laughs> You're still thinking about that rape, huh, Kumia? Sick fuck. Somebody in the uh, chat says, uh, beer's been empty for 10 minutes. You got it. I'm glad you're recognizing these frauds. Yeah, you, you look, look huge. Like, uh, Jesus, you I have big. never seen actually an intervention. someone so self-centered in my life. Thank no, I have. Oh I have. I was like, what are you yeah. talking about? I was like, we've seen the videos. <laughs> Whoa. <laughs> yeah. You really are. Um... We've seen the videos, a.k.a. the tapes. <laughs> Pretty hung up on yourself. I know. I think it's because everyone else hates me so much. <laughs> Are you despised by a lot of people? But I'd rather just like you know. Do my own Are you own despised own. by a lot of people? Do people like, f actually say, "Oh, I hate her"? The right people like me.
They do like you, right? Yeah. <laughs> do you think it's because you're cute? Whoa! Or do you think it's because they like you as a person? person. Whoa. <laughs> you're asking. <laughs> Look at me and Pat just start laughing. Person. No, but you're saying, like, well, how many people? I'm talking, like, four people. Like, oh, just four people. Yeah. Like, we're not talking about... You don't about need more than four not. people in your life. That's right? true. I, I'm not going to I'm not gonna totally disagree with that. You need someone to mooch off of. You need a friend to listen. You need someone to make you feel like you're better than them. And then a fourth person, just in case one of them dies. <laughs> they can fill that slot. I need to quote That's James good. Taylor right now. You know? <laughs> That's not metal. bad. I like that. <laughs> Bieber, write the song up. We got a hit. I like it. That makes perfect sense. It's important that you have all these, like, what you call uh, uh, transactional relationships. You know what I mean? They're, they're very important to have. You know but what's I, expected. Yeah. I feel like that's almost like, you know, say, redundant transactional relationship. What that's is a relationship? Why you're a sociopath. Well, <laughs> is that why I'm a sociopath or proof that I am a sociopath? I said it backwards. Chicken or egg. Because the why is probably genetic, yeah. but we'll never know. Well, yeah. You don't know your family? Oh, I do, and they're sociopaths. But go. did they <laughs> raise me to be like them? Who knows? It's the old nature, nature versus nurture. nurture. Yeah, yeah, I'd say it's a little of both. I saw you do a uh, roast battle uh, Thank you so at much. stand one night, and you were very good. Thank you. Who was I battling? I can't remember, but you destroyed. She right. has another one coming up. What is it? Tuesday. Tuesday. Oh, but this yeah. will already. Be, this is coming out too late. So in the future. Next week, it'll be two weeks ago. Oh, that's right. It was two <laughs> weeks ago, and it was awesome. Yeah, I fucking crushed. Destroyed. You can watch Mike and Kelly. You can watch me, Kelly. Killed Lindsay Jennings. You know that tatted up cow whore? What is that? <laughs> Whoa. Catted up. Oh, she's like cow a cow whore. Never too early to start the roast. No. Uh, no, I already beat you her. already beat her. Karen does a great Oh, I thought it was d coming up. Over. Micah has one coming up with another farm animal, and she's going to win. Um, it's uh, just like they, we're so cute. They like find the, our little like elf and selves. So cute how you include her. Yeah. I know. I was like, didn't we start the show by her straight up calling me ugly? Yeah. That's what they do. You know what I mean when I say that. Yes, you You're mean ugly. it. <laughs> well, do some of these? Do some of these the girls? Inside. Do some of these girls take it or, or guys? Whatever your roast battle with. Do they uh, take it personally and get like really guys are the get really mad at the you? Girls, the girls are chill as fuck. Yeah. Um, the once guys are the guys are baby. Faggots. Well, except Whoa. for the faggots. The gay ones are always real cool about it because they're used to being oppressed. Like the guys faggots aren't faggots. Yeah. Like oh. big J.O. Oh. 2017. All yeah. the Legion of Skank guys are. Faggots. Whoa. Like they'll fire us. They won't let us come on their podcast. Wow. All the Legion of Skank guys are faggots. I've said similar stuff. Uh, Big J, of course, is gay. Uh, Luis J. Gomez stole all my merch. And of course, Dave Smith, what he did to Reddit, despicable. Uh, so now you're hearing it again. You're hearing Kumia hear it. He's getting turned on. He's a sick fuck. Uh, let's continue. Because you said something mean on stage? Oh, you guys can listen to us on Kumia Network, and because uh, we just got fired We're not going to get oh. fired again. Oh. They can't fire us four times. If they fire us four times, that's crazy. Yeah, that makes them look that's bad. crazy. <laughs> that's insane. Why do you keep if going back? they fire back? us four times, that's yeah. on them. Yeah. Did they it's fire you them. three times, What? And, and you work for them now? I mean, Third time's charm. And you're complaining about it. No. So they won't let us hang out. They want us to work for them, and now I you do. I have a discussion about my counterparts. I'm not, I'm not complaining about them. I'm just trying to bring up some different like, ideas that I have. <laughs> Sounds reasonable. <laughs> about what pieces of garbage they are. <laughs> they are terrible people that we love to work so with. much. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, That's fine. you don't call yourselves Legion of Skanks because you're sweethearts, all right? It might be you ironic. What we mean. <laughs> it's, no? it's not. It's not ironic. Right if it was, <laughs> yeah, Legion really nice of Skanks. Guys, and yeah. they're just the sweetest guy. <laughs> Every show is a charity event. and. <laughs> Yeah, they're really nice. They, they like, do that. They like gender guys. Yeah, they're nice guys. They're, they've always been very. You know kind. them, but they are, you know, guys. They look like yeah. octopus people. These, These days, are it's boring very hard parts. for a guy to actually be a genuine guy because there's so much uh, baggage that goes along with it, and girls hate that. Go on. What, what do you, you mean? mean a, do? What do you mean be a genuine guy? Like a rapist or a nice Whoa. faggot? 